So, here's the plan for today. It's really quite simple. We are gonna go this way, and we're gonna try to finish the freaking prologue. Try might be the key word in that statement. Oh yeah, I said last time that I might do a little grinding. I did not. I did no grinding. Uh, that one. There. None. It's the same as before. Okay. Anyway. Um. Need to. There we go. Let me think. There we are. Uh, I need to go to the mines, but I also need to... this one? Yes, the Firefly Fungus. Grassy patches along the Malga Trail. Wait a second. How grassy. Yeah, I... Okay. You're in a grassy patch. Realistically, it is probably further in, but I feel like I should be thorough and actually check the, these spots. Uh, I'm liable to forget otherwise. <laughs> Estelle? Really? Again? You're really letting me down here, Estelle. Alright, we're good to go. Oh, the cat caught me. Oh, I almost ran into that cat. Well, this was a waste of time. Terrific! At least I can cut that out off of, out of the vase. <laughs> okay then. Okay then. This is where the path splits, right? It is. Okay, how? I'm gonna check this area, but I'm not gonna go through to the next. No, that's a nothing. Oh, that's a big pat patch of grass up there where I cannot reach it. Okay, yeah, there's nothing over here. I probably knew that, but well, now I double know it. Did not get a lot of experience, though, did I? Hmm. Well, I guess it's not- Whoa! I didn't see the bug until it was too late. But for- Okay, well, I mean, that hurt a little bit, but it's not really a that big a deal. I've seen worse, frankly. Oh, hey! A still level- Really? Ooh, that's interesting. And I got some wind power. Some wind se- Sephir? Which is good, because I kind of need it. Wind and time. Them are the ones that matter. Okay, let's, let's check out the, uh... Spin and strikes enemies in an area. Ooh. There we go. 
Uh, hmm. My rotating is causing that to move, which is a little... a little odd, but let's do that. Cool. <laughs> Probably a waste, but cool. Uh, no, no. Hit it the regular way this time, Estelle. That was definitely not cost efficient, but I don't care. It was cool. Oh, I forgot. If it hits Joshua, it still counts. I, I need to remember that. I need to internalize it because it feels kind of weird. I mean, like, it actually makes sense, but it feels weird. It is contrary to my expectations. I mean, I've settled on not grinding, but I'm absolutely gonna, oh, do the fights that the game gives me. Yeah, I thought that, that you'd be a little out of reach. 18 critical. That is not a big deal. Twenty-one is a little bit more of a big deal. Yeah, a little. Now, if I could get pummel range for emergencies, that would be nice. For uh, the CP, that is. Hmm. This screams mushroom to me. Oh! Every time I see it, then I turn around because I don't want to fight it on that, those terms. But then it hits Joshua and I'm fighting it anyway. On even worse terms! Oh hey! I'm in pummel range. Would you look at that? to the one who's not about to heal. Hmm. Speaking of, I wonder if I should heal. Well, oh. Oh, I blinded it! Cool. Awesome. Right, I was saying. Hmm. Actually... Sure. Let's do that. <laughs> it would have kind of sucked had she missed there. Oh, mm. Or had Joshua missed there, rather. I don't think you can miss with healing spells. <laughs> Pretty sure that's not a thing. Okay, this is the way I want to go. Don't need to fight the plants. Aha! I, I already said that, Estelle. What's with the sudden outburst? I found it! Now to claim our prize! Firefly Fungus! Cool! And I didn't even need to fight anything. Hmm. Yep. We sure show that what's his face all right. Sure. Olive. <laughs> it doesn't look all that tasty, but it sure is a pretty mushroom. Almost like the glow of septium, if you ask me. What 
What's up, Joshua? I may be worrying too much, but do you think you'd better put the mushroom in your bag quickly, Estelle? Uh, uh oh. The mushroom attracts monsters. But they're just cats. What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> no, actually, they don't seem to be very strong cats. I could have done this earlier, so. I think I could have done it earlier. No, actually, I could not have done it significantly earlier. Yeah, that did literally zero damage. That's a. That is a huge no big deal list. Mess. <laughs> We did it! Yay! Yep, it's all taken care of. That light emitted by raw septium has the power to attract monsters. This mushroom also appears to have the same effect. Fancy that. Uh, did it drop? Hmm. No, it looks... That sneaky merchant! He never mentioned a single thing about this. Anyway, let's hurry back to town. Just wait till I get my hands on you, you combat knifing merchant! Found white bracelet. The chest is now full of disappointment. Oh yes, I love that. That right there is probably going to be my credit roll for the VOD. Um, let's see that equipment I got, though. Oh! Prevents blindness. Okay, let's throw that on. Let's also save a save. Oh, almost ran into that. Not you, though. Not you. You know what? No. I'm not gonna let you hit Joshua from behind again. Uh, is it just me, or am I still getting hit first here? I'm not sure about this. Doesn't seem quite equitable. Oh, uh, you know what? That's not the one I should have attacked. Oh, well... Because, uh, yeah, I'm healing Joshua. Okay, well, you missed, so it's fine. I don't think these guys have Sephim attacks. Sephith attacks? Whatever. Magic. So it's probably fine letting them get that boost. Still don't need to fight you. Can't rotate the camera anymore, we must be in the mine. I mean, this does look mine-like. There's a dude there. There's not actually a whole lot over here. Hello! Miner Ladan. This is the entrance to the Amalgam Mine. If you're not here on business, then I'll have to ask you to leave. Believe it or not, we are here on business! What a concept, right? Roland's mayor, Claus, had asked us to come here and pick up a certain septium crystal. Well, all right then. If you've got a referral from the mayor, then that's a different story. I don't mean to make your job any more difficult, but you should mind going inside and speaking with the boss directly. Would you mind? I'm supposed to stand watch out here. Presumably, he has the crystal as well. Or maybe they're the same person. 
Uh, they are. Mr. Gaton. He manages the mine and all of the workers. He's the kind of guy who enjoys discovering a septum load. Iode. Load. More than eating three meals a day. I'm fairly sure he's working down in the lower tunnels today. Watch the mine be full of monsters. Calling it now. I do not have a map. So, uh, that's a thing. I guess you just don't get maps in dungeons? That would make sense. Oh... A minecart. RIDE THE MINECART! Wow. Wait. Wait a second. <laughs> wow, okay. That sound design is incredible. Like, that act- I'm wearing headphones, and I actually thought, like, that sounded like something that was actually happening around me. <laughs> what if I flip the switch? I guess I should probably see where the first one- Okay, there's an elevator here. But I want to see where the first one actually takes me. I probably should have checked that first. Wow, though. Seriously. That sound design is amazing! It actually sounds like real life! Hello! Great adios! I- oh, it's the goddess. Great goddess, what are you guys doing down here? Minor Miles. Are you friends with someone who works here in the mine? Uh, indeed. Yep, you got it in one. Well, if you're looking for the boss, he should be in the tunnels below. Oh, neat! Uh, okay, yeah, I mean, I, I already figured it out. Hello! Uh, yeah! I've, I've heard that a, uh, a lot, actually. It seems that the Tale games are pretty popular. Tale, no. Well, I mean, yes, the Tale games are pretty popular, but I meant the Trail games. Uh, they've sort of been on my radar for a while, but I've never played them until now. So, uh, here, here we are, in that regard. The sound design for this thing really is just perfect. It sounds like real life. Well, down we go. I think that was the idea, Estelle. Probably Estelle broke it. Oh, it's locked. I... Really? Okay, as much as I like listening to this cart, it is getting a little old constantly going back and forth here. down this pile. Eight games? Wait, eight games? I'm only aware of uh, the... Okay, so I know that there are more Legend of Heroes games, but I was only really aware of like the trail games, so the three trails of the sky... And the currently two, I think, Trails of Cold Steel. 
And uh, as for that, I was definitely planning on playing through all of the Trails in the Sky games. I might not stream them all, but I'm gonna play through them all. Um, after I finish those, I will probably start looking at Trails with Cold Steel, but like that's so far away that I don't, I don't know. We'll see when we get there. <laughs> yeah, let's use the key. It looks like we can use the elevator now. But uh, you said eight games. So what are the three games that I'm missing from that list? Like, ju just to be clear, in case it wasn't obvious, this is my first trail game. Well, that looks like some sort of machinery. Uh... Oh, there's a person there. Miner in training. <laughs> so you're looking for the mine chief, are you? I'm sure he's somewhere across the bridge. Okay, the bridge is probably the mechanized thing that I saw. Which was not this way. This way! Oh. Huh. What's this platform for? There's three Sky games, two Crossbell, three Cold Steel games. Wait, there are currently three Cold Steel games? I thought there was only two. Like, I knew there, there was one more coming, but I thought there were currently two out. And I haven't heard of Crossbell at all. Um, so, uh, you are telling me some news to me, is what I am saying. So, Crossbell takes place between Sky and Cold Steel? How, how, how do those games compare? I say as if I've even know anything about them. I mean, I've only played this one, and I'm not, still in the damn prologue, so... Uh, the reason why we've been able to work like this is due to the grace of the goddess herself. We best remember to give thanks. Oh? Okay then. He was here, but he's not anymore. Okay, I just saved, so... I did not just save, actually. What I did is I just healed. So, maybe there will, will be a boss soon. Okay, that's probably the Mind Chief then. So, what's over here? Oh no, it's another guy! Two more guys, actually. Looks like Trent was cutting work again. I can't believe he's still pulling the same stunts after the last earful he got from the boss. Aw oh, man, I ate a ton of food, but now I'm hungry again! Maybe I ought to try sneaking off to town for lunch again. Oh, okay. That would make sense then. Okay, so Crossbell have not been translated at all. I see, I see. Okay, that makes sense. Considering how massive the script is for these games, it would stand to reason it would take a while to localize, especially if they're doing it right. And uh, so far everything I've seen from Trails in the Sky tells me that they are doing it right, or at least trying to.